So the last part of building an instrument or a multi in contact is the use of modulators and scripts. And these are things which add movement and texture and intelligence to the instruments and multis that you built. Modulators modulate parameters in your instrument. For example, you can have an envelope that allows you to define how a sound changes over time. You may use it to modify volume or panning or filter or just about any other parameter. LFOs are low frequency oscillators, a staple of most samplers. They have periodic waveforms that can be used to modify any parameter that you map them to. There are other things that you can use as modulators, for example, what key you press, or a controller such as mod wheel or pitch bend, even randomization. And you can even use step sequencers to define patterns to control specific parameters. So modulators can do a lot of things, and we'll see later how they can modify just about anything in your instrument or multi. The last thing I want to talk about is scripts. Scripts add intelligence to your instruments and multis, and we've seen them in action every time we see a performance view, because underneath the performance view is a script that defines how that performance view works. For example, if you take a look under this synth, we see the layout of the knobs and buttons. And if we take a further look under that, we see the actual script. Now the script is essentially a program, and we're not going to cover in this course how to write this program. But the good thing about Contact is that there are many scripts that we can use, and we don't have to worry about programming them. They're already programmed, but we can use them in our own instruments and multis. And there are many, many complex behaviors that we can add to our instruments. Automatic harmonization, randomizing of pitch, microtuning, humanizing sounds, drum articulations, lots of very, very easy things to add just by applying a script to an instrument or multi. So later in this course, we'll talk about how to use these scripts, how to define our own performance views, and apply them to our instruments and multis. So that completes the overview of the instrument and multi layout within Contact. We'll now start to dive in deep.